And here's the truth. There are two enemies of Jesus, sin and religion. Two enemies of Jesus, sin and religion. Sin is about innovation. Religion's about tradition. Sin is about nonconformity. Religion's about conformity. Sin breaks the rules. Religion keeps the rules. Sinners tend to be liberal. Religious people tend to be conservative. Sin tends to be immoral. Religion tends to be very moral. Sin, sin tends to be disobedient. Religion tends to be very obedient. Sometimes sin is lazy and religion can be very hardworking. Sin tends to be visible, you could just tell. Religion tends to be invisible because it lives in the heart and the mind and the motives. Sin uses people. Religion judges people. Sin is unrighteous, religion is self-righteous. Before Paul became a Christian, he was a sinner, but his real problem was religion. Sometimes we forget that. He says elsewhere, I was a Pharisee. That's the strictest of the strict. He said, I studied under this leading rabbi named Gamaliel. So he went to like the best theological school. He probably memorized whole books of the Old Testament in the original Hebrew. Here's what he says. 1 Corinthians 15, 9 and 10, for I'm the least of the apostles, unworthy to be called an apostle because I persecuted the church of God, but by the grace of God, I am what I am. He says, here was my problem. I was religious. I was so religious that I was judging people and condemning people and opposing people and hurting people. I wasn't like Jesus. So two things, if you're here and you're a sinner, repent of your sin. What that means is agree with God that you need a savior and his name is Jesus. But if you're here and you're religious, repent of your religion. Your haughtiness, your self-righteousness, your boastfulness, your record keeping of wrongs, all the good things you've done and how you're better than others. Now me, I tend to gravitate toward being religious. Because see, I grew up in a poor neighborhood, working class, but I was the kid who never drank. I never did drugs. I never even took a puff of a cigarette. I wasn't a Christian. But I was really hardworking and I was a good guy. And then I started reading the Bible and I realized guys like me murdered Jesus. And we were the villains and not the heroes. And that it's not about me and my performance and my religion and my devotion and my zeal and my hard work and my great effort. It's about Jesus' grace and his love and his mercy. If you're a sinner, repent of your sin and trust in Jesus. If you're religious, repent of your religion and trust in Jesus. Jesus has two enemies, not one, sin and religion.